Welcome back. It's time to see what's clicking in Cleveland. So I'm going to send it over to our digital anchor, Stephanie Haney, who is monitoring all the big stories on WKYC.com. Hey, Stephanie. Hi there, Romney. You know, people have a lot to say about Governor Mike DeWine requiring masks of all students in classrooms this fall, and not a lot of people are happy about it. C.G. Powell says she won't have her healthy son, who is starting school for the first time this year, wear a mask and that the governor is not protecting her rights. I didn't see much out there in support of this, but Kevin Rasnick got close saying schools were desperately looking for guidance from the governor's office. And now we have this order coming on the mask issue. This parent said, if you know anything about kids, they'll go to school with a Spider-Man mask and come home with a flash mask because they've traded it with hashtags that bring up the most popular reaction that the best thing to do for the health and safety of employees, children, and families is just keep school buildings closed for now. Now, the Cleveland Clinic has just come out with a campaign telling us the many reasons why we need to wear masks, but what they're saying that we should skip is the gloves while we're out shopping. Clinic experts say it's not necessarily wrong to wear gloves if done properly, but using them the wrong way makes wearing them a bad idea. Infectious disease specialist Dr. Patricia Dandash said the problem is when people don't take off the gloves the right way, further contaminating themselves and others around them. Now, the experts say the best thing to do is just wash your hands often and thoroughly. And Romney, we are also just now learning that Cedar Point has canceled hollow weekends, but they are replacing it with something that's going to look a little bit different. And we do have all of those details so our viewers can read all about that on WKYC.com and on our WKYC app. Ooh, what a tease. I'm going to have to go to there because I need to see what the change is and if I might want to, you know, take a little trip out there. It sounds like they've got a little festival coming up that might be a, something nice, but not quite Halloween weekends, but we do have all the details online. All right. Sounds good. Thanks, Stephanie.